Hey, how's it going? Today I'm gonna go over how to draw an ice dragon. It's just gonna be from the head uh, kind of down to the neck and that's pretty much it. It's gonna be simple, easy, and for beginners. So that is all, okay? Follow through all the way to the very, very end of the video and that's where you're gonna learn the most. It's only an eight minute video. So it's really easy to stick to the end, all right? So let's get started. First things first, if you like learning how to draw dragons and all kinds of cool mythical creatures or things from cartoons or Among Us or you know, all, all, like, uh, you know, Pokemon, anything, I'm gonna draw it here and I'm gonna carry you through it slowly, okay? So hit the subscribe and click the bell notification right now before we start, okay? And hit the like if you like the idea. So let's jump into it. I'm gonna go over here and draw the eye of the dragon. It's gonna be kind of like this S curve up. Over here underneath, finishing that off. We're gonna go with the brow. Draw like a zigzag line for the top of the brow. Curve underneath. I'm gonna go over here and find the far side. So I'm gonna go over here over the top of the head, maybe draw like a thin line there. It's gonna be a texture, we're gonna use that out over here, gonna draw zigzags on the far side eye. Out for the snout, curve down here for the front of the snout, curving up underneath, and then pulling back into the mouth here. Gonna go over here to the nose, and right at the very end, I'm gonna draw this teardrop shape for the, um, the, the nostril, right? Curve over here. Gonna pull open, the mouth open, and I'm gonna draw the skin over here on the side of the, there's like a skin flap that lizards have on the side. I'm gonna throw thin lines going back and forth, kind of like an accordion there. It's very thin up and down to kind of show the, like the flexion in that. I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna draw the teeth down, curve that one down. All these are our little triangles. You can draw them at different sizes. All right, I'm gonna go over here, to the f I'm gonna pull the far side over here. That's the skin on the other side. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull a line down here for the bottom of the mouth, curve here and up for that bottom part of the mouth. Now I'm gonna draw the teeth aiming up. Curve in, curve in here, up. And I'm gonna go up here, up here, up here with the triangles. Different sizes. Curve out, down, curve under here. Out for the bottom of the jaw and pull up. So we got him roaring there. Pulling him around the back over here. I'm going to throw a line up. Back for a horn. Going over here on the far side. Up back, down for the horn. Up over here, curve, and there you go. It's gonna have like the neck kind of going off. Go over here to the bottom of the throat, pulling a line up, and then kind of curving here into the rest of the neck. You know, we're not gonna, it's not, we're gonna, I guess, do like the whole thing, right? He's gonna go on off the page. He's a really big dragon, essentially. And I'm gonna pull a line inward here because that's his throat and that's like more his neck. Line over here curved in for the back of the kind of the back of the ear of the lizard. And we're gonna draw a line. Sorry, I'm gonna go a line over here and I'm gonna curve because that's gonna be the under part of him. And then this under part is gonna have this texture. Zigzag right here. See this kind of like curve, curve in, curve. 
curve, curve in, curve in, curve in, curve in, curve in, curve in. And I'm gonna close this off on this side. I'm gonna give him a little bit more of an anger look over here. I'm gonna have it wrap around, it wrap around in here. Line up. Uh, and that's pretty much it. That is the, and he's going to be shooting. So for example, when he's shooting out here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab uh, two different blues. Uh, and it's going to be pretty simple to do that. So I'm going to grab like just one random blue, like a dark blue here. And I'm going to go and create this. Ooh, that blue is dead. We have, that blue is no good anymore. And then our, our, let's grab a different blue. Over here, draw that zigzag over here as it goes out. Go over here on, let's say over here. Zigzag over here coming back. Like so. So he's shooting that out. And then I'm gonna have a different blue, like a light blue on the inside. And this, by the way, you can do this all in black and white. So you can always just do this in, in like what I'm doing here in black and white to make it easier. Putting on the inside, like a lighter, kind of put more of like a lighter blue, but it looks very purple. Um, and if what you really want to do as well is, uh, if you want, let's go back into black here real quick, briefly. You can uh, draw a curve line at the top here, curve line at the top here, curve line at your over the snout, and you're giving him this textured look. These plates, right? I think they call them osteoderms. A lot of animals have them. Um, and you can go over here and draw the cheekbone in. Like so. The cheekbone really makes it. Forgive me, I should have drawn that in much earlier. And let's darken out the back part of the mouth here. So that it um, makes uh, more sense there. As far as within space. And that is an ice dragon. I will draw many dragons on this channel. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a playlist... Uh, of different dragons, so uh, stick around for that. I'm going to start putting a bunch of those up uh, as the weeks go by. So, like different positions, different stuff like that. I'm going to keep drawing these osteoderms up there just a bit. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to color him, uh, but I'm going to speed that part up so that it, you know, it's not boring. So that's pretty much it. But uh, hopefully you drew that. You can color him any way you want. Um, I am just going to color him, and I'm going to speed that part up. So stick around and watch the uh, color portion of this, okay? It's gonna come up pretty much right. Oh, before you do though, if you did enjoy the video, hit that like and also hit the basically um, share button. When you share it, it helps the channel out in general and it does a lot. Actually, what I'm, yeah, I'm gonna leave a, a, white, a white eye because I kind of like that look. Thank you so much. Stick around for the color. I'll see you in a bit.